There have certainly been disappointing ends to the season before for Jets fans. None could touch this one. As the NHL regular season ends today, the Jets will end their stay in Winnipeg. Pride from the arms of the loyal fans in the name of so-called progress. This is the new NHL, they say. Bigger, richer, but no one in Winnipeg today seemed to feel it was better. Community, one of the grittiest, hardest hitting Jets. Pleasure to introduce our executive vice president and general manager, Mr. Kevin Shoveldayoff, who will make our first pick on behalf of the Winnipeg Jets. G'day YouTube, it's Brett here from Overtime Gaming with you once again. As you can see from the intro, we'll be in the Winnipeg Jets in NHL 13 GM mode. Now, we're going to try and put that win back into Winnipeg. We're not going to try and rebuild as a lot of the other um, GM modes on YouTube are. We're going to try and win now, within this year or next year. So that means trading away future draft picks, future stars for a team that can win now. So we're going to get that started now. We're also going to tell you now, uh, we're going to skip pre-season in this episode um, because I don't care about pre-season, so we can start the regular season next episode. Um, we're also going to play every single game this year. That doesn't mean I'm going to show you every single game. I'm going to play every single game, but bring you highlights in each episode of the games previous because otherwise it would take way too long. So, let's get this underway. The first person I'm going after is a guy that used to play for Winnipeg and now plays for Pittsburgh, Tanner Glass. I really like him, he's a good third line player and he's cheap, so let's get him in. He's a left winger. We can give up Wildwood, wherever he may be. There he is, straight away, done. So there's one off our list. Get rid of that. Next player is a player you'd think I've got no chance. And that is Ryan Callahan. Yeah, once I can find him, actually, let's have a look at this guy first. No. Where's Ryan Callahan, guys? There he is. Now, I know what I have to give up. That's the opening. Hainsy and uh, draft picks. I think that's it. Oh no. So they want. Mm. Uh, we'll give them a second from next year. Oh fudge. Um, what do I reckon? Second and two thirds. Good. So there we go. I gave up a lot, but it's a top player that I really wanted. And like I said earlier, I'm not trying to build for the future. I'm actually damaging our future, but I'm looking to win the Sandy Cup now. The other guy is from LA. He's not a big name player, but again, he's just a good backup. Good third, fourth liner. That's Stewart. And for him, we're going to give up Mietman. 
No, no. Okay, no, we're not. We'll give up this guy. There we go. I know I gave up a lot for him, but it's wiping salary cap off and it's giving me a lot. And now Gunnison is the next guy. I can't remember where he's from. I know he's a defender. So there we go, guys. We're at Toronto. We're going to bring in Gunnison for a number of players. And the first one. Glitzum. The second one is a younger player who I have no need for. That guy. Because we're also going to be giving up a lot of draft picks, I want to bring in Brown. Just a player to back me up. Um, now we're going to give away draft picks for this, and I'm going to give away quite a lot. I'm going to give away this draft pick. A third from next year. And a second from this year. Oh, no. We'll go second in later years then. A second from this year. No. Okay, we'll change this third to a second here. Change this one then. For this. So there we go. We got Gunnison. Gave up a lot, but again, like I said, draft picks are just draft picks to me. I don't really care. Now, the other guy I'm going for is from, I think, Dallas, guys, and that's Roy. Derek Roy. And again, I'm going to be giving up a lot for him, but it'll be worth it this year. So let's find the guy they want. That's Lowry. We're going to give up a first, a third, and a second for him as well. Hopefully we'll get a draft pick back as well. So let's go find a first, and that's that one. A third. And we'll give him a second from this year. Let's see if we can get a draft, a late round draft pick. No. No. There we go. So we picked up a draft pick as well. Maybe a low one, but it's still a draft pick. So there's the trades for now, guys. So let me sort my depth chart out before we skip the pre-season. Let's have a look here. Is there anyone I want to bring up? I might bring up Shifley, but I'm not 100% sure yet. Right, so let's set best lines for now. That will do for now, but seeing as it's pre-season, I may swap this round a bit. So let's leave it like that for now. Uh, I might give up Burmistrov, thinking of it. And I think I will, so I'm going to do that now, actually. Which means I can bring up Shifley. Wherever he is, let me just find Shifley. Let's edit line so I can put him in. Let's find him. There he is. Put Shifley in. So there's that sorted. We'll leave the defence for now because we haven't got that many defenders. And let's give up Mistroff. Mistroff, and there is an older guy that I want to get rid of. And that is Mietinen. Let's look for a team that wants both, and it's Buffalo. What are they interested in giving away? We can get Pisic out of it. No. So let's not go to Buffalo. Chicago. Sorry. Let's try and get this one. There we go. So we got a player. Right. Let's sort this out then. Send this guy down. 
and this guy. So there you go, there's my line sorted. Let's skip pre-season, let's make sure I got injury off for now. Just while we're on pre-season, because obviously I don't want any of my players to get injured while we're in pre-season. We have, good. And let's skip all the way through pre-season up to the 8th. They want us to win 36 games this year. So hopefully we'll do that and more, in all honesty. Because I want to be winning the Stanley Cup this year. I don't think it will happen, but I'm hoping it will. Right, let's face it, anything's possible, so hopefully it will. So we're one and one. That's alright, that's alright, don't mind. Uh, we lost again, so we're one and two, but we did lose to the Tampa Bay Lightning, who are a good side. So let's skip a little bit. And let's. Ah, so we went one, two, and one on the pre season. Okay, that's not too bad. Right, guys, I'm going to end the video there. In the next video, I'm hoping to bring you some big news. I don't know if it'll work, but I'm hoping to bring you big news. And we'll get the first week of the regular season underway as well, to around here. So we should have one, two, three, four games done. Okay? So peace out, YouTube. We're going into overtime.